Well, good evening to you and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town and uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too and uh, all of it adds up to make it terrific a crackling atmosphere the match i think will be quite a spectacle one glance and you know where we are it is one of the most recognizable arenas for the beautiful game in the world and boy does it add to the occasion It appears to be a 4-4-2 formation, Jim. Well, the modern version of that is a lot more fluid and flexible than in bygone times. There is a much greater understanding of the need for players to cover forward running and it enables risk-taking while the gaps are filled. I'm very much a fan of it. There are a lot of people who seem to have kind of ignored it and just put it to bed, but it still works, it's still valid, and I think we're going to see it be successful here. So it's away we go then. Hendrick, and it's played forward, kings it out wide. And it's McClay. Defenders on the back foot. Duffy. Battles to win it back. Oh, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Hoists it forward. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to go and he didn't go for the back heel. It's McClay. It's on a plate. And he's there to hoof it away. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. McClay. McClay plays it forward. And the assistant referee rightly gives him offside. Just brushed off the ball there. And that's put paid to a promising move. Tries to locate someone up front. And that's been won straight back. Neither team has yet managed to impose any authority and uh, as a consequence this game's just drifted. And the whistle's gone, presumably for offside. Gets it upfield. Hoists it high. That's the through ball. Long. 
Oh, the ball's come loose. That's been drilled forward. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. And here's the long. Yeah, that's top defending in preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Made towards the front men. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. And here's the long. That's a goes for goal! The keeper deserves some sympathy there. You may not have seen that until too late. Ireland get themselves into the lead. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. It's got away. That's oh, great defensive work. It doesn't take too much imagination to guess what would have happened otherwise. Well, he was thinking about headlines, I'm sure, but... Hits one! Oh, just over. Look, I'm sure he'll deny it, Peter, but the keeper didn't have that covered. back and showed him a yellow card tries to get it forward quickly and that's been lever clear Get the better of his opposite number. Long. And the counter is on. Oh, well played, he saw that coming. Forward it goes. And that's sprayed out wide. Oh, that is lovely footwork. Out towards the flank. Gets it back. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Just the talking to, I think. Yes, it is. Keeper's ball. Now it's long. He's left his man. Has a goal! Good first touch and almost as good a second. Yeah, the shot was enabled, Peter, due to such smart control and technique. Played out to the right. That'll be a throw in. Oh, good ball. Trills one in. Goes for goal. He's pulled off a fine save. 
The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Goes for the cross. Cleared away. And the freeze had a look. And he's played his whistle for half time. And there we are. Off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. But there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Reflections on the first half. Well, I think there's plenty to be pleased about with that first half display in terms of the score and, and overall approach. Ireland go in at half time with a slender one goal lead. And we are already promptly back on the way. Well, it's been tight, Peter, but I'm expecting things to, to open up now and we get some free flow in football. Shoots! That has certainly tested the keeper. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. And once more, they can't get through. Long. McLean. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Gets into a dangerous position. Here it comes, and he's made sure that that won't get through. Keeper sends it forward. Tries to get it forward quickly. Ireland really are almost trying to pass the ball through a brick wall at the moment. You can see the sense of anxiety has... Has, has a pop! Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a chance to meet it! Decent attempt, but not quite good enough. Hoist it forward. Now it's long. Your impression so far, Jim? Peter, they're leaving nobody guessing now. This is a decisive attempt to go further in front. Tries to get it, and they've been caught. He's had a go! Good try. The outcome could so easily have been different. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. Well, there's going to be another change here. Done very well to intervene. Caught offside that time. It's good stuff. This is better. Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. A couple of changes then in quick succession. to clip it forward. Hendrick, and it's played forward. 
Well, no doubt someone is being given special treatment here. Yeah, and having notched a goal already, Peter, he's not going to be allowed to run off the shoulders as much as he'll want. Oh, good interception. Hoists it forward, and it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Lobs it in gently. Clears it out of harm's way. And managed to get it away. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? And it's played forward. Plays it out to the flank. Oh, shooting chance! Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. Well, they're being caught out too much for my liking. It's not rocket science. Look the changes then in quick succession. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but... He couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. Keeper's got good distance on that. Forward it goes. And it's hoisted clear. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Plays it out to the wing. He's got options out wide. And he just whacks it away. Tries to get it forward quickly. It is now or never. Time is against them. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue the situation, and it needs to be any time now, really. Good challenge, he just stood firm. He's played him through. Ireland probably could have killed things off, but they should be OK here. 90 minutes up, we're into stoppage time. Ireland just have to run down the clock. And there goes the final whistle. What a game. End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Well, a result with...